What's up and welcome back to the channel. Hope everyone is having a great day. And welcome back for display vlog number two. We are gonna be going over uh, my second NASCAR display here, which has the yellow, orange, and red cars. The first video we did uh, went over all the black, silver, and white, and had a bunch of my favorites, including a bunch of car culture chases. So if you haven't seen that one, go back and watch that, but let's rev up here for episode number two. And here we go with the yellow car. So starting it off here up top, we have the two Nissan Z from the more recent Hot Wheels Premium 2-pack. We have a Corvette CAR, the Bugatti EB110, a, I believe that actually is a Matchbox Corvette C8, and then Corvette C6, like race car. And then this is Definitely a cool one. This is from the original Hot Wheels Speed Machines. So I just really like this livery. Just think it is super, super cool. And it has those classic cold mold wheels, which are very cool. Then a very popular, I believe this was from the Fast and Furious set. The little Civic hatch, the nice little carbon roof, black TE 37s. And I do apologize if I get any of these cars wrong or I mix them all up. I'm sorry, but I'm sure you will correct me down below. We have the sweet Subaru STI. Uh, is this Hawkeye? I believe this is the has the five spokes. Really, really nice. Come down a couple more Nissans. Nice Porsche GT3 RS with a wheel swap. Got a nice Mercedes. Some Porsches, nice Porsche Carrera. Sorry, not the Carrera, the 918 Spider. This one's actually a matchbox, but a very cool cast. And one of my favorites, the Lamborghini Countach. I love these wheels on this casting as well. So we do have the chase version of this car. I do wish Hot Wheels would come out with one with the wing. I know the RLC model, has the wing and I really dig it. We got an old school Viper, then Porsche Carrera, I believe from the newest Exotic Envy set, yellow A90 Supra, Sesto Elemento, Sweet Prelude. This one is just super nice. I love this yellow with the black hood, red interior, the white five spokes. And this thing looks super, super good. I don't remember where this one's from, might be a five pack, I don't remember. What else do we got? The Lamborghini Urus, Audi S4, then a Lamborghini Gallardo. Uh, is this a Super Leggero? This looks, I mean, it has a Super Leggero wing there on the back. Um, is this from like a Gran Turismo set? Can't remember, I think this is from like a Hot Wheels specialty set though. And now let's run down the orange row and we are starting it off with a banger. We got the Porsche RSR Turbo. And this thing has some very nice metallic paint, these gold lace wheels, nice air-cooled big wing in the back. This one, super, super nice. I mean, that paint, yeah, that one is good. The new Lamborghini, is it Cyan? Then the McLaren P1, Corvette Z06, another Subi, very nice. Like I said, I believe Hawkeye, this one in orange with the black 10 spokes. We've got a McLaren P1, Volvo, another Lamborghini. So the Lamborghini Gallardo Superleggera from Hot Wheels, man, I really, really like this cast. Super, super clean. So I think I have it in Maybe three or four different colors. But very nice. Then we have the Lamborghini Aventador Mira Hamaj. And then the Porsche Carrera GT. That's what I was getting confused with that guy earlier. But in this orange and black combo looks super, super nice. Very cool. And this very pretty Honda S2000. This orange paint. Super, super metallic. Let's see if I can get 
get some good light on it. But yeah, super nice orange paint. This one would be a good candidate for a wheel swap. Just get some nice real riders on there. Then the last two, we have a couple Porsche 935s that I did some wheel swaps on. So these are Mod My Ride staggered like deep dish TE 37s with the Adban Yokohama tire lettering on there. Uh, I think I painted that little front grill or intercooler. And it looks like I painted just the little exhaust tip. Uh, I believe this orange one was a like a Best Buy. I know it was like a store exclusive. Uh, then I also did the Ultra Hot. This one has the same wheels, but like a bronze color. Super, super nice. And up here, started off with the red. We have the nice BMW E46 M3 with the chrome 10 spokes. And we got the Mark III Supra, which is the mainline version. A couple of the Liberty Walk silhouettes. We have the crazy R34, and then that's what, the R30. We have this nice Audi wagon. This is from part of the new Silver series. I just really like the slammed look in these new four spokes. So what is this thing? RS6 Avant. Yeah, this thing just looks super good. Then a nice faster than ever Ferrari 458. Uh, no, F430 with the staggered FTE wheels. Might need to send that one down the track. Then we have the then and now Mark IV and Mark V Toyota Supra. We got the Mercedes with the nice chrome 10 spokes. We got a Lamborghini Huracan here with the custom wheel swap. Let me get in a little better light, maybe. Uh, this one has the 10 spokes. I did the custom like red painted lip on them. Add a little, little extra flair to it. We have the Civic the EF hatch, the Koenigsegg Aguera, the new GT3, the GT4 or GTS or something. BMW M5, really, really love that cast. Super nice, I believe Porsche GT2. And there is the red version of the Aventador Mira Homage, which I believe is the main line. And then there is the Super Treasure Hunt variation, which I do not have yet, unfortunately. Then is this the, what is this? Is this the Aventador Roadster? No, the Centenario Roadster. The Centenario Roadster. And then another uh, speed machine. This one is the Ferrari F430. Yes. This one's super nice. I raced this one down the track and it actually fell off the track and kind of got scratched up a little bit, which I was super bummed about because I just cracked it open and it is not a cheap car. So luckily it didn't take too much damage. We have a nice R33 Skyline, another convertible Ferrari, Mark IV Toyota Supra. This one is super nice. I don't know if this was a, I know Car Culture or Boulevard. It's got the Nitto logo there. The nice black TE37s. This one's super, super cool. Like I said, the, this red definitely has some nice cars in it. Like especially these last couple rows here. Got the red R32 Skyline and then a, another speed machine with the Ferrari 599XX. This one's super, super cool. Those black cold mold wheels with the red lip. And this thing just has full deco, front, back, rear, everything. Super, super nice. I did race that one down the track too. Luckily he stayed on. And we have the Lycan Hypersport from Fast and Furious, and then the Nissan 300ZX Premium with some nice TE37s. So that is it here for this display case. So I hope you enjoyed this little vlog number two for our second mass car display case. Um, this one I think maybe needs a little work. I think the yellow rose there and the orange maybe lacking in a couple spots, but 
Still kind of combing through all the jammers and just seeing what other cars we could add in, but I feel like this is a pretty good start. So I am, I'm trying to work with Mascar right now to try to get a discount code for you guys on these displays. Um, so yeah, comment down below if that is something you'd be interested in, because I really, really like these displays and would highly recommend them. Just price and ease of install, and it just looks super, super clean. And you can see it has the dust covers, which reflect light. You can see my light in that one. But if you do a video, you just take the dust cover right off, easy access. You can see everything when you're done filming or messing around with your cars. Just put the dust cover right back on and you are good to go. And that is going to wrap up today's episode. As you can see here, I did end up getting more G Fan Garage dioramas. So we completed the whole entire back wall is now covered with light up garages. So that will probably be another video updating you on all those. And I also am cooking up quite the video right now. If you see this little mad scramble of cars down here, you might notice something in common with all of them and have a hint at the upcoming video. But Thank you for stopping by. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and we'll catch you on the next video. Peace.